Well, there you go. I haven't uh, adjusted the valves yet, but you know, bad boys work just like they're supposed to. And what it is is they just got loose, and what you got is you got a little uh, thing right here to tighten it down once you get them adjusted with this bolt right here you tighten them down with this one somebody probably you don't never know there's an a roped on that <laughs> I don't know what that means but anyway uh they probably didn't tighten them torque them down good the uh lash screws right here you know so uh well i'm still gonna get the parts and i'm still gonna get all the gaskets and everything for it and I'm still going to pull this flywheel off so that I can clean the uh, generator real good and uh, clean the magnets out and then clean this flywheel up. Clean the coil and, well, I had to see how long it's going to take, but it'd be next weekend. I'll have this motor all back together. Uh, the front tires is iffy. I've got to find tubes for them or uh, I'll buy up the... Uh, valve stems and just get some uh green slime and put in there and show you how to make a rim pop back up i mean a tire pop back up on that rim <laughs> i don't like them stems though that one there that is almost impossible to put a chuck on so there you have it uh i tore it down and i inspected it you can see that valve works really well uh, exhaust valve working really well and if you look, piston head's clean. I'm sitting here looking at the piston head. It's clean. Well, well there you go. Enjoy. Peace. Watch that valve. Watch intake, exhaust. All right. Exhaust, intake. There you go. And the motor's tight. Uh, Emery cloth seals, uh, debatable on that camshaft now, uh, and gaskets, really and truly. I mean, nothing wrong with the motor. Peace.